Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. As you can see, this is going to be the Decorate With Me for Christmas video, um, the one that I promised in the last one. I'm gonna bring you guys along as I decorate my house and show you all my tips and tricks and ins and outs of my holiday decor. This year, I incorporated the color green, which was super fun. Green was my favorite color this whole year as I feel like it was a lot of ours. So I figured why not keep it going and bring it into my holiday decor. Um, so I will make sure to link down below everything that I use. I will try my best and yeah, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel, especially if you like videos like this, because I love interior design and home decor, and there will always be a lot of that incorporated on this channel. So please stick around and I'll go ahead and plug myself here. This is my Instagram. Make sure you follow me over there as well. I try to translate my YouTube to Instagram pretty well, so I do post reels over there too. So um, as always, I appreciate you guys supporting me and without further ado, I hope you enjoy the video. All right, you guys. So this is what we are looking like. Basically just Christmas everywhere. So this is kind of what we're working with. Um, I am going to go ahead and start with the tree first. I told you guys I was super worried about this basket and dun dun dun, it doesn't fit. It doesn't fit, but I'm gonna try to make it work. I don't have any kids or cats, so nobody should be touching the tree to make it fall. So I'm gonna try to see if I can have it sit on top and disguise that with the tree skirt. I know, super fucking sketchy, but I'm going to give it a try and I'm hoping it's going to work. And my house is dirty, but tips from Tay, don't clean your house before you decorate for Christmas, clean it afterwards because you're just gonna make a big huge mess anyways and you'll end up cleaning twice. So yeah, nonetheless, we're gonna go ahead and get started with the tree situation. I just wanna get everything in its spot because all of this clutter all over the place is giving me anxiety. So here we go. All right, so now we gotta figure out something to do with my olive tree because this is the spot where my other pencil tree goes. And yeah, I'm gonna need to find another home for this. So I think maybe the guest bedroom. We're on the move. Ooh. This is the room that I don't show much because it is nowhere near decorated, but I think maybe I can fit it over here in this corner. And All right, so this corner is the corner that I typically put my tree in. So I'm just going to move this bar cart out of the room totally. I typically just put it in the spare bedroom or in the garage. Um, I have a small house, so it doesn't fit in here once I put all my Christmas stuff up. So. And so like I said, I got this basket and I am going to try my hardest to make it work. And I'm going to leave the tags on just in case it doesn't work. Makes my house super dirty. All right, you guys, I figured it out. So I lowered the tree so you can't see under there as much. And now I feel like it's perfect. I still got some extra height on the tree, but you can't see straight under there. So you can't even tell. This is like just, it looks like there's just fabric bundled in there, which is exactly what I wanted. So it worked. 
It's a celebration. One thing about these fake trees is that you do have to come in and spread out the branches. Make sure you guys do this. It will make your tree look a thousand times better, fuller, and more realistic. So this is a step you cannot skip. All right, you guys, I did do the ribbon off camera and I put the picks in. I typically just put a bunch of picks at the top of my tree instead of a tree topper. And sorry for the lighting. I also put them throughout. So I do have, I have these picks just like that. And then the white berries and the sticks. So yeah, and one bulb. So I'm just gonna start decorating the tree. Here's all the stuff. And I do want all of this stuff off my dining table. So I'm going to start putting it together. All right, you guys, it's time to, here I am. I'm gonna throw away these pumpkins and I'm actually gonna get rid of this pompous, not get rid of it, but store it with the other pompous that I took down in the guest room. So that's what we're doing. This is ridiculous. I hope you guys are seeing just how much stuff I'm pulling out of these bins. I'm feeling a little overwhelmed. This is a lot going on. <laughs> you guys I'm barely making any progress <laughs> but some love this little guy over here we have that was for fall but I'm gonna leave it for winter because why not it has some green in there I have some more so I might switch it out I don't know I'm trying to beat the sun you guys it's really hard here is all my tree decor so yeah still got a long ways not this garland being the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my long time right? and me leaving Denzel to Where? a little bit higher wait a little bit to the right no the left I mean left 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 there no right 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 a little bit lower. A little bit to the right. A little bit down. 
right there. And now we stick this on top. Try to just make sure that it's like even on both sides. Get off that bed. Mindful movers. Contact them if you need any moving help in the 559 area. <laughs> Anywhere in Central California. Anywhere in Central California. Oh, they travel. My bad. My bad. Look at this sad girl. Because we've been neglecting her. Are you so sad, mother? Because we have not been playing with mother today. Because we've been doing Christmas. You want me to throw that so bad? I cannot. Your dad is right here. I'm helping him. You hear me? Huh? You better not mess up my garland. Me? No, I'm talking to my Maya. Get, get your get your mic. Oh. Uh. All right. Here's the time you've all been waiting for. The big reveal, the after shots, and how everything pulled together. I really hope you guys love it as much as I do. The vibes are immaculate. So I can't wait to have a date night and watch all the Lifetime Christmas movies and Hallmark because it's super vibey in here. So I hope you guys love it. I guess I really don't know what Christmas is all about. to the end your real one per usual i really hope you guys loved how i transformed my space for the holiday season this year i hope that you guys found some inspiration or learned anything from my method of creation and i just really appreciate you guys always tuning in and supporting me don't forget to like the video leave a comment and subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys in the next one thanks so much